Okay, welcome back to Roving Reporter. Today I'm here with Aisha. And today's theme is science. So I'm going to ask her five science questions. And you're, she's going to try her best to get as many as she can correct. Okay. So the first question is, name the five human senses. Sight, smell, uh, hearing, touch, and taste. Good job. So one point. How many bones does the adult human have? 206. Good job. Two out of five. What powder do flowers make? It's pollen. Three out of five. What are the three hu states of matter? Um, solid, liquid, gas, and there's a fourth one, plasma. She got extra credit for plasma. That's, so now we have four and a half. Okay, the last final question. How long does it take the Earth to fully orbit the sun? 365.25 days. Yeah. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's this, yeah, there are leap years, so it would change. You're right. Okay, so she got five and a half out of five because of her extra credit. You got the highest. Really? Yep. Okay. She's, she's the winner. What do you have to say? It's not entirely appropriate. Yes. yes. Hi everyone, here are this week's announcements. Um, th uh, this week our teachers had first aid training and um, here are some pictures from it. Our, our teachers now know what, how to do CPR, per say less when choking, and etc, etc. Um, here are some middle high school PE updates. Um, here are some of the beep test results. Well, actually, here are the top beep test results. Here are the to top boys track event results. Here are the top boys field events results. Um, while I'm on the no note of PE, I would like to mention how unfair it is that boys got to do like multiple multiple different um, PE units, I guess, or activities while the girls have been doing rounders ever since the year began. Um, we are celebrating Qatar this week on December 14th, and there is an art competition and that should be submitted by December 12th. Um, the, the entries will be displayed on the avenue and Maidan um, after the break. Um, here is Dalal. Talal and Bilal from pre K um from two A K G and pre K three. Um, here is Bilal's artwork. Um, Talal's. Um, this is one Wu's artwork from one B. Uh, Dalal Nadas from two A. Um, Ahad's from three D. Zane's from three B. Maila's from four C. Um, Ananya is from 5D. Um, here's a few picture entries from Abdul Rahman Shad from 8D. And this one from also from Abdul Rahman Shad from 8D. Um, there is a yearbook cover competition on there's a yearbook cover competition and basically the winner is going to Hat like is gonna be the the person whose design is on the cover of the yearbook. Um, here are the requirements. You have to must be on the theme of the ten year anniversary, open to students from grade ten nine to twelve, must be school appropriate, and due date for designs is January thirty first. Um, you should submit designs on um, Power School or through this QR code. Um, as you, most of you probably know, on Wednesday we're not going to have normal classes. We're going to have Hour of Code. Um, basically, our teachers are going to teach us the basics of coding. Um, the Winter Spirit Week is a week. On Sunday, we have Shaman Day. On um, Monday, we had Ugly Sweater Day. Today, we have Wear All Maroon. 
because it's Carter National Day, and tomorrow is going to be wear all white. Um, as you all know, Wednesday is the last day, and after this, we finally get to go on the winter break and rest ourselves for, you know, three weeks. Um, Wednesday, December 15th is the last day. Wednesday, January 6th is when we, all of us are coming back. Uh, for all of you that were wondering about report cards, semester one ends on January 20, so around that time, expect them. Expect the report cards. Um, thank you so much. I will see you all after the break. Enjoy, enjoy your time. Bye. <laughs> Welcome to Ducks Week with Alia Jaffrey. Why can't dinosaurs clap their hands? Because they're extinct. What do you call a Minecraft meeting in real life? A block party. What do you call the weekend from Friday to Monday? A long weekend. That's all I have for you today, and I hope you have a great day and a great week. This week, um, Slav from 3B participated in the online National Speed Chess Individual Championship on Sunday. There was a technical glitch that put Slav playing against participants from 8 to 20 years old, playing almost half his games against kids more than twice his age. Slav was still able to win two matches, draw one, and out of a total of eight games. Super job, Slav. The basketball team are back on the court playing some friendlies against ASD this week. Well done to the boys and girls teams. <laughs> 